Hey guys, uh, today is August 8th, 2008, <clears throat> and what you're looking at basically here is um, my E8400, which is now, after running for, well, you'll see how long it's been running, it is fully stable at 4.005 gigahertz, or 4,005 megahertz, and I will show you how long it's been running here. And I can honestly say I deem this stable. 19 hours, 44 minutes. I'm going to let it run for probably another hour, maybe two. I might as well just finish up and run a 24-hour test just for shits and grins. But um, basically what we're looking at, um, show you the temperature here. With core temp 2.7, the newest one. We're looking at 5757 on each core. My uh, core zero sensors come back to life. I'm very happy. That's our temperatures. Um, I they are about a degree or two higher than what they were. I raised the temperature in my room. It's up to about I think 72 right now, and uh, it was 70. Surprise so 71 in the case, give or take. And here you go. At 1.352 volts. Not a not a bit too soon to be hitting 4 gigahertz. I'm at about one more notch and I'm at the max that I can run 24-7 so we'll, I tried to push it to 40 I think it's 40-50 or 4.05 at these same specs and even with FSB set to 1.2 still wouldn't run basically we're running our memory here one to one of course crucial ballistics at 900 megahertz or no it's 880 megahertz right now I'm sorry 900 was a uh, 450 by 9, but we're only running 445 by 9, if you can see on there. Let's go down and show you this again. This is, as you can see, small FFTs set on priority 1. Because really, I've come to find if it's stable, I don't think it matters what priority it's on. Uh, it seems like the higher priority, and uh, if you run it on uh, large FFTs, which goes and stresses some of your RAM too, that'll actually push it harder. But like I said, it's been running for almost 20 hours, and it's never going to see this kind of load. So it's about good enough. I got to get the phone. Sorry for the interruption, guys. You guys have a great day, and uh, hopefully higher overclock soon.